Greetings from Stars Hollow. Come with us on a beautiful fall day to three of the small towns that inspired the beloved TV show, Gilmore Girls. We have coffee in hand, my plaid shirt is on, baseball cap backwards, and my wife is wearing an outfit that both Rory and Lorelai would fight over. This is a good day to experience Connecticut's small town charm. We begin our Gilmore Girl Day in New Milford, where the gazebo looks like you've just stepped onto a filming set. And I have to admit, I got a little emotional when I saw it all decorated for a fall festival. What an old-fashioned dream. New Milford feels the most like Starch Hollow to us, with its revolutionary history and Victorian buildings lining the streets, the town green, library, church steeples, and small businesses all add to the illusion of walking through Stars Hollow when school has been let out and the town is bustling. Next stop is Washington Depot, the town that inspired the writer Amy Sherman Palladino when she stayed at the Mayflower Inn. There's a food market like Dosey's where you can totally picture Dean packing groceries and across the way, a beautiful bookstore called the Hickory Stick Bookshop. Next door is Marty's Cafe, which might not look like Luke's Diner, but is a nice and cozy spot in the center of the town. They have great coffee and treats that would make any Gilmore girl proud. As the sun sets, we find ourselves at the last stop where Luke briefly lived in Litchfield. At the end of our Gilmore Girls Day, we think about what makes a small town so charming. Is it things like used book sales, antique stores and old barns, or town festivals? Or is it moments like when the cafe owner knows how you like your coffee, or catching up with a friend on the town green? We realize that the real life Stars Hollow is not only one place, it is the best of many. It's the families and townsfolk that make the heart of any town feel like Stars Hollow. We would love to hear what charming moments in your own town that make you feel like you have a role in Gilmore Girls. Thanks so much for watching and bye for now.